don't give in to depression and being bummed out. I didn't wake up <laughs> in a very good mood today, but here's what I did. I decided I was going to start to count my blessings in my gratefulness. And that started to turn things around because at first I was emphasizing all of the stuff that's wrong and how I want to change this and that and that's not changed yet. And So you can get caught up in that. Thinking of things to be negative about. And there's a lot of bad stuff happening, yes, I know. And I don't even want to repeat it right now, but it's not a good way to wake up. And there's this part of it that you can stop, get a hold of yourself, get up. It did help to have coffee. Caffeine is such a good drug. It's the really the best one. Um, I felt a lot better after having some coffee and then I did some walking and movement helps a lot. So this is what I'm learning. I did another video about walking for depression and if you can just get yourself up and moving a lot of times some idea is going to come to you something will change so i'm i'm there with you because it happens to me too i don't i don't wake up perky every day it's a practice to switch out of the negative and not dwell on it. And there's plenty of things to dwell on, but you know, you can take care of those things later or pray about it or meditate. But you can keep yourself out of a really bad space, but it does take effort because look, you're not starving. Chances are you have a roof over your head. And oh, I'm out in the wilderness cooking. My rice is starting to overboil. Um, and then I came up to this campsite above uh, Palm Springs. So I'll leave you with that. It is a practice to keep yourself in a good space. Now, when you slip out of it though, that's, that's when you start to slide down and you gotta notice. And I didn't, wake up with a good attitude so you can switch it don't play over all this negative stuff because it's going to dissipate so I'll see you in the next video and enjoy your now moment I know we hear that but it is a practice and there, there's other things you can do besides switching things in your head you can call someone you can go for a walk you can have some coffee you can eat something you can um, <clears throat> Think of someone you love, call them, do something that you love to do. One time I was completely sad and I started making my photo cards, which I hadn't made in a long time and that just com totally got me out of it. So, there it is.